Hey, what's up guys? I'm gonna be showing you guys in this video how to restore your brake calipers. Stay tuned. First off, you're gonna need some paint, any color that you choose, some clear coat, some trash bags, and some tape. Lowe's or Home Depot should have just about everything you need. Next, you need a scrub brush, a bucket of soapy water, and then you'll probably wanna buy some stickers. Get, make sure you get the high temp stickers on eBay. Uh, you can get them specifically for your car, for your brakes. Finally, let's just go over the order of operations here real quick. Um, you're going to want to jack up the car, remove the front wheels, then you're going to wash and clean the calipers and dry them afterwards. Uh, mask off the area and all items you don't want to paint. Uh, take your time here. This will really influence the quality of your paint job. You paint them. Uh, I did three coats of color and then two coats of clear with five minutes in between coats. After the final coat of color, I'll wait about 15 minutes, apply the sticker, and then do your clear coat and then remove your masking at the end. Put the wheels back on and then repeat at the rear. All right, so you can see my brake calipers, pretty faded, gross. Just finished taking off the front wheels. Um, going to be masking and then painting them uh, nice and red. Curious, um, under the car. Right here, there's a cutout. This is where you can jack it up. And then we put the jack stand right there. I use soapy water and a brush to scrub down the brake calipers and then I finish it off with brake cleaner to remove all the dirt and grime to help the paint stick. Once you're done washing the calipers, you're going to want to proceed to masking them off. This part of the project is going to take the longest and this is the part of the project that you're going to want to spend the most time on. So masking really is going to give you your final result, how clean it looks, how good it looks. So you're really going to want to take a lot of time here. Uh, make sure you mask everything off really nice. Put up all of this back here. You can tuck this in pretty nicely. Um, tape down here on this uh, wire. And make sure you mask off everything else around your car because you don't want to get paint on all of that. Um, mask off the bolt heads back here. Um, the way you can tell, you know, a cheap paint job from an expensive one is just how well you do your masking. So if it looks nice mask and you paint it nice, nobody's gonna be able to tell. But if you do a crappy job painting, paint your wires and everything, it's gonna look terrible. So just make sure you get a good job. Then your first coat, don't go too heavy. You don't want any drips. Um, just get a light first coat on there, cover it all, and then move to the second coat in a little bit. I waited about five minutes between each coat. Uh, make sure the brake caliper looked covered and completely covered and well coated in paint. Uh, after that third coat, I waited about 15 minutes to put the sticker on the brake caliper and then I let that dry a little while and then I would move to clear coat afterwards, and which again would be about five minutes in between each coat. I put two coats of clear coat on. So then this is the finished result. Once you get all your clear coat, remove the masking. Should look really nice, nice and clean. Anything else you can touch up or clean up on your own, whatever you like, but it looks good. All right, so here we have finished product. You can see it looks pretty nice. You can see it nice uh, behind the wheel. The red on black looks really good. Go to the other side. Same thing, really nice, looks good. So there you go.